Hey everyone, and welcome to Talk with Chad. And in this video, I'm going to be installing uh, Windows Media Center 2005 Service Pack 3 using a Sun Virtual Box. Uh, now, just to note that I will not be stopping my Microsoft Office um, videos. I am just sort of postponing them for now because I just don't feel like doing them. So, just to note, I'm still doing them. So, um, anyway, to the video. Uh, what you want to do is you want to get a working ISO. Um, for Windows Media Center 2005, uh, which I've got, it was off the Pirate Bay, um, 600 megabytes, I believe, pretty small, and uh, I just go up to new, next, and um, oh yeah, you can follow this tutorial for any virtual box setup. Uh, my name, er, long name there, um, and for operating system, uh, sort of other windows, next, and for the memory size, um, I think I'm breaking it down to a nice juicy gigabyte, because I might be using this in the future, uh, for episodes or something on, vi or on uh, XP, so I'll give it a gigabyte of RAM, which should be enough, um, next, and uh, boot hard disk, um, I'll just create a new hard disk, next, Next, it'll be, uh, I think I'll make it 8 gigabytes. Start. Should be good. Okay, there we go. So I got an 8 gigabyte uh, hard drive there going on and all that. So I have it started here. I'm just going to start. Okay. Next, media type, see your ROM device, host drive, I'm going to image file here. Um, now, where do I have it saved? Let me see here. I think it's my documents. No, that's not where it is. I'm going to quickly, quickly find it here. Um, it's in... Oh, okay, it's in my downloads folder. There we go. Downloads. Oh, yeah. Okay. There we go. Here's my ISO. And uh, let's open it up. Select. Next. Finish. Now, this is the first time I've done this. Now, normally I do things beforehand before doing my video. But uh, this is all from scratch here. So, uh, bear with me. Um, press F2 to run automate. System recovery. No, I'm not going to do that. I have to set it up to install it. Might take a while. Do -do -do. You know, I'll probably skip through this setup. I'll skip through it in like sections or something. I'm not sure. Okay, here we go again. Um, that went through. So it says set up Windows XP now. Press enter. Okay, I press enter. Ooh, big license agreement. Uh, F8 is. I agree. Let's just go ahead and agree with it. Uh, our prote unprotected space. Uh, 8.189 megabytes. Sounds good. Um. Do NTFS quick. Um, oh, that went by surprisingly fast. That went by very fast. That's also going by very fast. Well, we're halfway now. Three quarters of the way done. Good to go. Five, four, three, two, one. Boom, we're done. Please wait while it's set up and initializes your Windows XP configuration. Ooh. Your computer will reboot in 12 seconds. Okay. To restart your computer, press enter. Okay, let's do that then. Press any key to boot from CD. No, I don't think I'm going to do that. Hoo -hoo -hoo, Windows XP is booting up. Let's see how fast it boots with one gigabyte of RAM. Well, that was fast. That's very fast. Oh. Um. Great control, okay. Remember that? Oh, let's do it again. Well, 
Now I can move my mouse around inside. That's a step. Setup will complete in approximately 39 minutes. Okay, with a little bit of editing magic, I will see you in 39 minutes. Um, well, we're back. And, um, 33 minutes are left, so not much time has gone by, and now it's asking me to configure my regional and language options. Uh, next. Oh, my name organization. Luckily, I know my name and organization. Yes, I make lots of mistakes when I'm typing fast. That's normal. For me, it is, anyway. Ooh, prod key. Um. Okay. That's not good. I don't have one. Uh, entering your product key now is optional, but okay. It. Oh. Um. No. Oh, okay, that was easy. Imperial name. Um. Cheese. Minister password, okay. Looks good. Friday, November 13th, 2009, 5, Sounds good. I am Mountain Time. There we go. And now it says 32 minutes to go. Okay, that's the Soil Network. I will see you in a little bit. Wow, that was quick. Networking settings. Oh, it's probably the most annoying part of setting up a computer with Windows, in my opinion, it is getting the networks to work. Especially with XP, that was a real pain in the butt. Um, let's get do typical settings. Because I have no idea what I'm talking about. No, this computer is not in the network. Um, okay. That was sort of a short little piece there. Yeah, let's, um, Start recording again and uh, see you when the next pop up arises. Okay, I'm back and um, display settings has popped up to improve the appearance of video elements. Windows will automatically adjust your screen resolution. Sure. Uh, okay, so made the thing bigger. Uh, Windows has adjusted your screen resolution. If you do the test, okay, continue. Okay, continue. Uh, Windows XP, please wait. Now, note this is me yesterday, 2005. The really cool theme. Um, I've never run Media, Media Center before, so this will be a new experience for me. I've been an XP Pro guy, uh, mostly. Um, back when I did run XP. Now I'm, of course, in Vista. And, um, hopefully... Oh. Okay. Who else does I see this video? Thank you for your purchase of Windows XP. Well, I didn't purchase it, but, okay. Let's spend a few minutes to up your computer. Sure, let's spend a few minutes set up my computer. To continue, click next. Okay. Uh, sure. Why not? Let's turn on our Mac updates. Cursor's laggy, but who cares? Check in my internet. Yes, this computer will connect. Next. Um, I do not want... Sure, I'll activate Windows. Who cares? Um, no, not at this time. Continue. Oh. Who will use the computer? Um, I didn't want second, third, fourth, fifth users. So that was nice. Okay, that was a quick setup. Welcome. Uh, it's been a while since I heard that Windows XP sound. It's a great sound. It's been a while since I used XP actually, probably over a year since I did my last XP tutorial, if I'm not mistaken. But I have not used Media Center, so this will be interesting. Why is this not Media Center? This is supposed to be Media Center. <laughs> okay. Um, it's Windows XP Professional. That was not what I was supposed to be getting. Um. Hee hee hee. That was sort of strange. Oh, whatever. Um, anyway, 
and it's told us I can do XP videos and stuff, so it's still the same. Um, anyway, uh, that's sort of a weird conclusion of the video, but, um, see ya. This video is probably getting super long, so I'm gonna cut it off right now.